Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again. So today we are going to talk about Biden skipping COP28, the uh, climate conference, because it appears he is not going. And we're going to do this because I got a message. And the message was basically, hey, I was hanging out with some of my friends and they are very much environmental people. And when the subject of Biden skipping COP28 came up, they were happy about it. I didn't want to uh, ask them why and seem dumb, so I'm asking you. Okay, so if you're not familiar with this, it is a meeting. It's a conference that occurs. It has occurred numerous times in the past. And uh, this year, it is going to be hosted in the, the, the UAE a massive oil producing country, you know. The host of the conference is the boss of an oil company. And reporting came out saying that the UAE planned on using the conference, the, the climate change conference, to uh, work out new oil and gas deals. On top of that, we are on COP28. This is the 28th one of these. And uh, we still don't have a, a plan, pledge, to phase out fossil fuels. There are a lot of people who believe that this has turned into a getaway for heads of state and their closest associates. And it's not really about the climate anymore. There are some people who believe that him skipping it will send a message. The U.S. won't be unrepresented. There's a bunch of other top officials going, but Biden himself is apparently skipping it. So there are people who are very much into the environment um, who kind of view this as a good thing, view it as sending a message, saying this is not what this conference is supposed to be about. We're not coming. And I can get behind that. I don't have a problem with it being hosted in the UAE. Climate change is real, and it's going to impact every country. They have a stake in it. The oil and gas deal thing? Yeah, I mean, that's an issue. Um, so I, I definitely understand where they're coming from. The, the other thing I want to point out about this, though, is that may not be why Biden's not going. Um, people may be assigning a motive to that that isn't really there. Um, it's worth remembering that the President of the United States is currently dealing with trying to get aid to Ukraine, the situation in the Middle East, a legislative agenda that has froze because of the dysfunction in the House, the budget coming up, so on and so forth. There's a whole lot on his plate right now, and a couple weeks in the UAE, long trip, maybe it just doesn't fit. But I'll take it. Whether or not he is intending to send that message, I, I think that message is going to be sent. So, okay. <laughs> uh, this is one of those moments where I'm not going to argue with results. Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.